Okay, by popular request, today's interview will be about Uncle Wayne. When did you find out you were going to have a baby brother? <laughs> the day they brought him home from the hospital. <laughs> <laughs> you had no idea that your mother was pregnant before no. the baby was born. No, I didn't. Did she Nobody know? Nobody did. She didn't she know. She knew it. <laughs> she knew she was pregnant. That's good. Okay. Did, did Peepaw know? Yeah, he must have because he took her to the... <laughs> All right, and but she just shared this with no one. No baby shower, no baby sprinkle, no. nothing. Nothing. But and, but tell, tell him how, how Uncle Leon told it. I don't know how he told it. Mom, you tell it. Okay. Um, he told Wayne that... Um, you know, he was he was older. He was 17 or 18. Right. And uh, his mom and dad came to him and said, we're going to go to Plainview and uh, we'll be back in a couple of days. And he thought, oh, good. They're having some time together. <laughs> and, uh, and so he... Um, so he was responsible for all the animals, all the kids, everything. Uh -huh. And so... They were gone a couple days. They came back and they had a baby. Oh my goodness. And nobody knew. Wow. I don't know that any of the neighbors even knew it. Wow. Okay, so how old were you when Wayne was born? Uh, 16, I think. 16? Okay. I don't know. She must not have shown very much. Or was she just overweight? What? What? How does a woman, like... Because if, that would not <laughs> happen to happened. me, for she, sure. She, she was, you know, she kind of was heavy. Around the I middle? I never thought about her being fat, though. Uh-huh. Just heavy around the middle? She was a yeah. tall, big woman. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I think that's hilarious. If that, it is. <laughs> it really is. There's like a whole... Um, what's Unbelievable. Called? Like, a uh, show about that kind of thing. I didn't know I was pregnant sort of thing. <laughs> but he turned out to be... Now, what was he like as a child? Oh, he was he was precious. He was the greatest. Everybody yeah. thought he was. Okay. How was he as a teenager? Not so great. <laughs> <laughs> but as a man, a grown man, he was the best. The best. That is so great. Um how did he come to know Jesus? Do you know that uh, story? It, well, I, I don't know what went before, but when we lived in California and he lived in Texas, mm -hmm. and he was married, and I guess they were having problems because of him. Mm -hmm. And uh, he, uh, Ron was out here, you know, and he came out and Ron and him studied. Mm -hmm. You know, all the time he was out here, which was two or three days, uh -huh. and uh, and he changed his life totally. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and just great. And the guy. rest is history. Yes, and he has been a huge blessing to our whole family. Yeah, and left quite a legacy. All right, say goodbye. Bye.